What's up guys? We're finally taking off to Turkey Bay Off-Road Trail. Located in Kentucky, we're in Murfreesboro, Tennessee, about 30 miles away from Nashville, and we're making about a two hour ruck all the way to Turkey Bay. Um, it doesn't have the biggest off-road like rankings, it's not all the way up to five, six, seven, but it's leveled about one or two. So it's a nice little scenic trail around the lake. We got the dog, we got the forerunner, we got the girlfriend, we have an American flag. So we're taking a little day trip, running out there. Hopefully it's a little bit of fun and uh, stay tuned. All right, so we are 28 miles away from Turkey Bay off-road. Um, they're open. I don't know how much it is to, to pay, but we'll figure it out. Again, the trails are pretty easy there. It's not like Windrock or Colmont HOV, Black Diamonds. Um, I think they might have hard trails there, but right now I'm running a stock uh, 2019 Toyota 4Runner SR5. No lockers. Um, got some rock sliders and cool lights and a Prince of Roof Rack. So mall crawling at those check marks, but off-road really not prepared for that um, I have the Predator tires which are like 31.6 almost a 32 inch tire um, the Predator steps that came with it removed those bad boys traded them for um, TRD rock sliders that come with some some units so I got that have a little bit more clearance and right now I'm waiting for my old man Emu three inch lift to come in from Yoda Mafia I ordered that on November 3rd, so right now we're about like five weeks out from them shipping it. I don't know if you guys have heard or when this video comes out, but right now there's a problem with um, the OME lift kits. They were coming from the Nitro Chargers to like the Nitro Plus. It's a different model, different strut, I believe. Also different springs that come with spacers. So um, I spoke to one of the co-owners of Yoda Mafia and they don't want to send me my lift kit yet because of quality control. A lot of the lifts that if you order a three, you're coming to five, you're coming to four and a half inch and that's not what you're buying. So they're trying to um, fix the issue in house and they're waiting for ARB to, to fix that issue over the holidays. It's been taking a little bit longer, but once that lift comes in, I'll probably make another video coming from stock to a three inch lift and I'll still be running the same uh, Predator tires. They're Firestone Destinations, A2s I believe, um, AT2s, and I'm really happy with that tire. Got no complaints, they're quiet, they've been performing off-roading, um, but once I get that lift, I would love to go to 34s, maybe do a Viper cut, a little uh, body mount chop, we'll see what we have to do, but right now, we're getting off Hops Hopskinville, Hopkinville, whatever, man, country roads. So Hopkinville, and let's see how it goes. Definitely gotta get some gas, and probably wake up the girlfriend here soon. So right now we just made it to Turkey Bay. Um, this is actually 100% free, they said, if you just wanted to follow the trail around the lake. There's a little dirt road that goes. Um, they said that's free, but I also paid. It's a $20 admission to get into the off-road park. They have easy, moderate, and difficult trails. We'll do a little bit of that here coming up soon. But as you can see, this is the lake. Some people are camping out. They got Jeeps over there. Here's the Forerunner and um let's have some fun
pretty fun so far just circling the lake and being able to follow the perimeter is pretty fun. They said because it's winter time, um, the low tide is out right now, so you're able to go around and have a good time. Um, as you can see, we have our dog taking a crap, and there's probably some side-by-sides coming and some dirt bikes and all that cool stuff. And um, if you guys are within the Kentucky, Tennessee area, Ohio, uh, come check out Turkey Bay. Um, it's a good time. So we finally made it back from Turkey Bay off-road. Pretty fun. Um, if you guys are going out there camping, I highly recommend that. Or if you guys just want to go out there and grill for the day, take a little burner, flat top, barbecue, kick back, bring some chairs, and go off-roading and have a little cookout. Or if you guys are not from the area, then obviously uh, camp out there. They have a really safe campground. Um, a little correction as well. They had easy, moderate, and difficult trails, and I got to go back for another run, but um, definitely looks fun. So if you guys are in the area of Turkey Bay, borderline Kentucky, Tennessee, give it a trip. And if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up.